Hi guys, story time, story time. Tum -tum, tum -tum, tum -tum. So today I want makeup, really correct makeup. I don't know if it's correct, but I was just playing around with makeup and I got this new set from um, NAS and um, I think the color is a little bit lighter than my skin tone. Anyway, story time, story time. Tum -tum, tum -tum, tum -tum. If you're new to my um, channel, please click on the like button and also share my video and leave a comment. This By doing this, you're helping me increase my reach. And also, if, if you're watching from you, um, um, YouTube, please click on the subscribe button. You know, leave a comment and share my video. If you're watching from Facebook, please like my page, share my video and invite all your friends. So how you all keeping? What are we going to be talking on today? Wow, I've been thinking, what should we talk on? What should we talk on? I'm going to be talking about milestones for kids. You know, especially for new new, um, new parents, they always worry about the milestone of their kid. Oh, my kid cannot say his alphabet. It's already 24 months old. I saw the other person's kid the other day. The baby is 16 months old. The baby is saying the alphabet. The baby knows color. My kid is three years old. My kid doesn't know color. Every, every child's milestone is different. It's very, very different. So, especially when it's your first child, you are wondering, oh, or even sometimes your second child, you'll be like, oh, my first child was not like this. He picked up very easily. How come my second one is not picking up very easy? Please let your children grow. Their ma Every child's milestone is different. Stop comparing that baby to your baby, that toddler to your toddler, that one to your one. Stop comparing and stop stressing yourself. As long as you're doing the right thing, as long as you're giving them the right food, as, you, as long as you give them the, the, the right diet, you know, uh, healthy meal as long as you're teaching them things and the thing is if also you want them to one thing about children one thing you should know about kids they don't really learn toddlers don't learn they don't they acquire it's called acquisition child language acquisition everything that they around them is they acquire things that's why you see if you if you if you bring um if you um if you speak another dialect to an adult it takes a long time for an adult to learn another language Whereas children, you can speak if there are 10 people with 10 different dialects in the same house, the child will pick all the 10 dialects. Why? Because they acquire their body is like a sponge. They suck things. They suck things. So if you want your child to, you know, to, the, to fasten the milestones, in some cases, you have to do things that they will copy. You, so, for example, you're saying, oh, my kid's my, my three years old or my four years old doesn't know the color. And the other people, they know. So I'm making, you know, oh, everything in your house, start talking about the color. Oh, this table is yellow. This uh, plate is blue. This uh, um, tumbler is red. If you keep saying things like that, before you know what is happening, they'll acquire it. They'll just learn it. They'll just acquire it, you know. So... Stop getting yourself overly worked up, overly bothered and saying and, you know, panicking because that's one thing, especially new mothers, they're always, always worried. The truth is, if there's something distinctively wrong with your child, a toddler, you would know as a mother. You, in your heart, you, you even take the child to, to the hospital. But those mothers are always saying, oh, my child cannot, he doesn't, you know that there's nothing wrong with the child. You're just worried and stressing yourself and even stressing the little child. So stop worrying about um, uh, their development if you know that there's nothing distinctively wrong. And just allow them to flow. Just allow, give them time to be able to catch up, you know, with their development. See, my um, my little boy, because my firstborn, when I had my first child, oh my God, I wanted him to, even at 12 months, I wanted him to know colors and alphabet. I wanted him to learn everything. I just wanted him, I needed him to be, you know, he was my firstborn child. So I was like, oh, so if he misses one color at 12 months, because he started talking early when he was about 10, 9, 10 months. So if he misses the call, I'll be like, oh, he doesn't know it. Oh, I'll be panicking. I'll be stressing myself. I'll be like, oh, there's nothing that doesn't come around my head. But look at him today. Girl, look at him. He is way, way above his age. His level is high and everything. So what am I saying? I'm saying that let us be patient with our growing toddlers. Let us allow, give them room to breathe. But if you, in, but if you really want to, you know, speed in their development, like I said to you, that they acquire things, just they they learn from you. They learn from you. You make you make up color everything in your house. Don't just say the chair, just say the yellow chair, the pink, the pink table, the pink. You know, make a, emphasize on the colors. If for example, I'm giving an example with colors. If colors were your problem, alphabet. If you want them to learn the alphabet or their phonics, start singing it around the house. You know, like I told you, kids don't really learn per se. They acquire now toddlers. They don't learn. They acquire. It's as they grow up, as they grow up, they start learning 
for, for, for when they are younger, when they are babies and, you know, toddlers and all that, they just acquire, they just sponging. And that's why we have to be careful where they are. We don't just say things or do things because they acquire all those things. So, so for example, you're all, always opening your mouth to, you know, to use the F language. The child would naturally just use the F language because that's what you say where they are. They, they, they copy you. They copy. They are imitators. They copy you. They sponge you. So we have to be careful where they also, where the things that we say, the things that we do, where they are because they sponge. So to all the mothers who are worried, I'm just trying to touch on this topic because I know a lot of first mothers are always worried about their uh, milestone for their children. There's nothing wrong with the milestone for your child, okay? So there, we've talked about that. What are we going to be talking about? Really, this makeup is too too light for my... Hmm, it's, too the, it's too light for my, my skin. But I'm trying it. Go try... I think actually use every makeup I used today was muffin, the foundation and everything. But the powder, the highlight powder was from um NAS. So I think it was too light for my skin. Although the, the foundation was okay, was the, the the powder was too light. And if in case you're asking me, yes, I wear my makeup myself. I do practically I learned as a mom, I learned a lot. I learned a lot. I do practically everything myself, my makeup my um i can even fix wigs <laughs> although i have a wig factory i i own um, antibetes hair so if you want to be a distributor contact me uh, i make i make uh, i make hair you know hair you can be, buy any you want to buy ten thousand pieces of hair i can you can be i can i can supply you you can be my distributor wherever you are whatever country you are we supply to any country and we give you 75 percent discount just in case you're wondering. So um, I think I've um, really, this this makeup is too, too, too light for my shade. Though. E, e, I, I'm not feeling it at all on me, but not, it's not bad. Just the, the color was, the, the shade I, I use is too light, extremely light for me. Anyway, have a great day all. I hope I have, because a lot of parents are always, oh, they call me Betty. My child is, uh, don't, don't worry, your child's going to be okay. Oh, okay, yeah, okay. Have a blessed day all. Bye. Remember to like my video. Remember to share my video. Please share, 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 share my video. And please invite your friends. Help me grow my channel. Thank you. Bye-bye.